Time now for Back to the Basics in Healthcare with Balanced Life Chiropractic. We have Dr. Harley joining us. How are you doing, Dr. Harley? Hey, John. I'm doing fantastic. I am so excited about tomorrow. I love yeah. food. So let's talk Thanksgiving. Yeah, Thanksgiving is, uh, it's you know, it's right here. Uh, and the cool thing is, this time of year, people always talk about eating too much turkey, getting too tired, and falling asleep. And you just told me that that's not really why we fall asleep. Right. It, the turkey's not the problem. You know, the turkey gets the blame. It's like, oh, don't eat turkey if you want to. Tryptophan. Wanna... Right. Everyone's like, ah, oh, tryptophan. Don't eat if you want to go Black Friday shopping. You know, when stores were open Thanksgiving night. Oh, or, yeah. You know, like, we don't want to fall asleep. we got to go shopping, right? So everyone's like, oh, it's tryptophan. Avoid so, that. So that's kind of a myth is what you're it saying? It is. The biggest thing that causes us to be all sleepy is the amount of food that we eat. That's why I'm tired all the time. <laughs> how many other times of the, the month are you eating that much food in one sitting? Yeah, for me, often. That's that's the problem. <laughs> uh, I'm getting better, though. Yeah, you guys are on a, I heard you guys are on a, like a life change. You've lost yeah. some weight. So congrats to you guys. That's yeah. exciting. But uh, basically what's happening is we pump our stomach so full of food that it basically kind of is like overwhelmed. They're like, oh my gosh, it's so much food. So what do we do? We shut down all the other processes, not like completely shut them down, yeah. but we move more into rest and digest, yeah. which is where we get sleepy, but then our stomach can manage all that food and digest it. So all good things. Nice. So everyone's like, so about tryptophan though. So it's an amino acid. So and we, that's, it's in other things too, besides mm-hmm. turkey. Right. And other things that we eat every day, yeah. you know, milk is the number one uh, source of it okay. whole milk especially oh wow so those of you that have uh, milk with your cereal in the morning or in your coffee yeah you're not falling asleep on the way to work right. i hope so, right so it's like you're, you normally eat it or it's in canned tuna oh wow but as well as chicken and turkey so i mean huh. your lunch meat sandwich middle of the day that kind of stuff like so it's not necessarily that the tryptophan is the cause but all of that food now, tryptophan does lead into, it creates uh, serotonin, which okay. is like a precursor to it. So that's, you know, the feel-good hormone, the happy hormone, that kind of stuff. That's why we're so happy on Thanksgiving. <laughs> right. Maybe. maybe. That, and th- and maybe As being a, thankful and hanging with your family. Ooh, I'm just kidding. We'll go back to the tryptophan. Just, just kidding. <laughs> it also is a precursor to melatonin as well. So eventually it will break into the sleepy hormone as well. But but if you really want to fall asleep, just skip right to melatonin, right? <laughs> Apparently. Right, right. <laughs> so, yeah. Very, very cool. So are there things as people are preparing for tomorrow, other than uh, maybe not eating so much, but are there other things they can do to maybe get through this the best way they possibly can health-wise? Uh, just eat and uh, forget about it the next day and get on with your day. I'm just kidding. <laughs> right? I mean, one, one This is day. why we love you. <laughs> I'm all about balance, right? There you go, balance Let, life. You know like, what? If you're going to overdo it tomorrow, then maybe underdo it today and underdo it on Friday. But then, yeah, it'll all balance out. Right. Uh, and always good to have like some sort of digestive type help, you know, eating more fibrous food, you know, taking a probiotic, make sure your di- your digestive system's ready for all that food. Nice. I really like kombucha. That's one of my favorite digestive uh, help thingies. Like I always get to have an upset stomach or constipated diarrhea. It just really kind of helps Take care of that. flush the system is a good nice. way of looking at it. But also it's promoting good bacteria. So. Very nice. So maybe add that to your, uh, your Thanksgiving regimen. Right. Very nice. Well, thank you so much. Happy Thanksgiving yeah, to you. Happy Thanksgiving to you. And if somebody may be listening, they probably won't be able to come in tomorrow because you guys will be closed. But if they would <laughs> right. say, hey, I'd really like to start maybe getting my health in order and getting things, uh, you know, putting that in the front seat instead of the back seat, how do they get a hold of you at Balance Life Chiropractic? This is a great time of year to do it. Everyone's always think, you know, we're starting to look into 2023. Oh, I can't believe I said that. Yeah, but, it's uh, weird. You know, bettering our health. And now it's a great step to at least start thinking about it. So they can reach out to us at 605-215-1785 or shoot us a message on our Facebook page, Balance Life Chiropractic. We'd love to chat. Very nice. You can find them online as well on their website. And that has the phone number and links and everything at balancedlifesd.com.